The Tamil Nadu Congress leaders and Carter are on a march to the Raj Bhavan in Chennai protesting against the summons issued to Congress leader Sonia Gandhi and the three-day questioning of Rahul Gandhi and the summons issued to him to appear again tomorrow. They call this political vendetta. What is the Congress's political message through this? What is your political message? Sir, the uh, anti-democratic forces, they are want to capture the India by army, by anti-democratic way of approach. They entered the, our national party's office without any warrant, without any complaints. How it is possible? And another one, Indian army is here very famous and very sacrificed army. Now, Bharatiya Janata announced a four-year course. Is it a degree course or postgraduate course? How can a boy enter the army with only four, four years? This is not proper. They want their booth agent through army. The state Congress leaders are being detained as they try to march to the Raj Bhavan. In fact, police have given permission only for a standalone protest here and this is being seen as a defiance of that restriction. As we speak now, the state Congress president, Alagiri and other top leaders and many other party workers belonging to the Tamil Nadu Congress are being arrested, are being detained and taken into police buses here. We condemn the BJP and government for the atrocious act against Congress and the leaders. With me, a few Congress workers here. Thank you very much for your time. What is the larger message you're sending? See, the message we are going to give is it is totally a revenge one. And Modi wanted to take revenge of Rahul Gandhi. He's scared of Rahul Gandhi. That is why he's filing unnecessary cases against him. You're also opposing the new Agnipat scheme announced by the Defence Minister. What exactly is the objection? Sir, the Congress party totally against the Agnipath of the Defence Minister because the BJP wants to recruit RSS, Hindu, Viswa Hindu Parishit Army fellows into the Agnipath. Totally the Congress against. Violence that has taken place in several states amid the Congress protests. No, it is not a violence actually. It is a protest we are showing it. Pieces of vehicles, properties being set on fire. No, no, they are, they are, these are all things are done by RSS. BJP Gundas. Has this issue brought Congress back to life in a sense across the country? Yes, sir. People are nowadays, they are gathering. Why? What is the reason? You know, they are going to push the government. They are going to change the government. They are going to remove the Prime Ministership Modi. They are going to form new, they are said they will ready, they are ready to support new government with the leadership of Raghulji. And At this issue, they say, in a sense, has turned into a flashpoint across the Congress ahead of the 2024 Lok Sabha elections and this, they say, is also rejuvenating the party. In Chennai, with Suresh, Sam Daniel, Find the TV.